We're broadcasting live from the Dirty South Dome in Atlanta, Georgia, where the living's easy and the sushi is called bait. I thought you said her name was Susie. Uh, but you're right, she did look a little older. 15 at least. And today's matchup is going to be a good one. The teams are taking the field. Terror Bay Mutineers take on the Atlanta Vultures. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. See that boo, baby? I'm the greatest. No, you didn't see that because I'm too fast. <laughs> everyone Grim Blitzrow with you on MFL game day hey uh Briggs do you smell something burning well wow, thanks for reminding me I left my rubber foot in the toaster oven to warm it up last time I left it there too long it came out like Saganaki uh -huh. it's freezing in here hey why don't you take a shampoo and ouzo stick your head in the toaster oven that'll warm you up And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hot eight. First down. Give this guy a few catches and watch his confidence take off. He is deadly in the open field, Bricks. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hot eight. Second down and a lot. And they pick up nine with that catch. Uh, not enough for first, but still a nice game. Third and two. Hot. Hot one. Eight. Nicely done for a first down. It's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Eight. He is running like an old guy looking for a bathroom. Oh, man, he just went off the rails of a crazy train and murdered that guy. <laughs> Gotta love it. He should bite his head off for an encore, Grim. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot. Oh, a great catch, and he picks up a new set of downs. First down and three. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hot. Second down and four. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hot. Third down and the punter is warming up. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot eight. And he stayed with the receiver and deflected the ball. And kickers practice for this kind of kick every day. Pretty standard. Nothing standard when you got bloodthirsty mutants on the defensive line. He's got the distance and the kick is good. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. He sets up for the return. Let's see if he can break one wide open. You ever get hit in the head with a boat all grim? Nope. Well, I have on several occasions. Not surprising. Multiple times on each occasion. Not surprising. And trust me, that hit was what Offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery.
First down in a mile. Hot, hot one. Second down and ain't gonna happen, partner. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot eight. It's two yard run before he stopped. Third down and never gonna happen. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot. Great throw and a great catch. Yeah, but, but it was in there. Oh, he just got crushed. First and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. Hot, hot, hot. The defense called it a sticky ball dirty trick, and the quarterback is in a shitload of trouble. <laughs> He's trying to throw the ball for him, but it keeps coming back to him. <laughs> Second down in a very lot. And an eight-yard gain on that one. Like when Bricks' mom decided to move back in with us. Third down and, well, hot, good luck. Hot one, hot two, hot three. And that pass finds its target. A pickup of six yards on the play. Well, this kick is no guarantee. Sure it is. If he misses, he's fired. Guaranteed. And it's good! You know, Grim, in this league where murder and bribery are cheered, it's good to be good, huh? I mean, can't we all just... Not this shit again. Bricks, I'm stopping it right there. When you get knocked down, you gotta get right back up and fight. Now, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. First and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot three. He refuses to go down. <laughs> like a monkey trying to... Ouch! What is this, 80s wrestling? Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. Welcome to the Great Rage. How can I help you? He could go all the way. First and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. And picks up maybe a deuce at most. Uh, speaking of deuces, I got a, uh, <clears throat> hey, you got a dollar for the bathroom attendant? He threatened me if I didn't tip him next time. We've got a nail biter at the end of one.
And that'll be second and eight to go. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot three. He is fighting for every... Don't you just love the sound of bones snapping and cracking? I mean, when they're not young. First and ten. And the defense gets another pick. Oh, and that one's going to hurt. He may not be able to comprehend math after that hit. What's math? Exactly. Ghost. Ghost. First and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. Boom! And like the Titanic, his ship just went down. Hey, hey, I almost got that mutant bingo. All I need is 77 to bite it. First down and six. All week the quarterback said they'd blow up the defense today. <laughs> he was right. Kapow! I will heal an old fellow. Second down and six. They're all monster hits, Grim, because, you know, they're all monsters. Point taken. Yeah. Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. The kick is good. crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. He's just making up ground. Yeah, like the way the commission makes up news. Second down, the size of Bricks Wiener. Hey! Sorry, partner. No one was open downfield, so the QB threw the ball away. They'll 
offense lost another running back and only to remain on their roster. When a team loses all their running backs, they lose their ability to run the ball. Yeah, like if I rip out your tongue, you won't be able to speak. Tell us something we don't know, genius. Third down and a pussy here. Hot one, hot two, hot Well, here comes the punting unit. You know, punters really do know how to party, Bricks. Yeah? Oh, yeah, I have pictures that, uh, do well, maybe actually shouldn't discuss this on the air. No return on this punt. The defense will just down it. I can't tell if he's smart or scared. Either way, the ball is down. And it's first and ten. defensive play that was bricks kind of like your aunt bertha this guy has some big balls what a hit yeah she does have a big pair grim you're right i hope you covered your ears and he's off to the races look at that little mutant run uh, i don't think you can say that grim oh my god And it's first and ten. The receiver makes a grab for five yards. Second down and five. And that's another pick. Man, oh man, the defense is going to hit. He finds open spaces running toward the end zone. Oh, the unstoppable force meets the explodable object. First and ten. At this point, with multiple. Boom, and he's dead. Oh, bingo, bingo, bingo. I got bingo, Grim. He just put that guy out of his misery and says, Who's next? Must be their lucky day. He broke free and has open field in front of him. He scores. He earned those points on the heels of an epic run. Nah, don't call things epic, Grim. Kids aren't going to think you're cool no matter what you do. Junior, I don't want kids to think I'm cool. Now, there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sick. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. goes into their two-minute drill. What the hell is that? It's the same thing in the hurry-up offense, you moron. He zings it in there for a four-yard gain. Second down and first time out under two minutes. The chess game has begun. It's like chess only. You can kill people. Time to speed things up. The offense goes into a two-minute drill. Another interception. Gives you give this guy a bigger paycheck than ever. Oh, that's a vicious hit. And the crowd loves it. He just turned that guy into 300 pounds of ground mutant meat. And you can't hit a guy much harder than that. And that is unfortunate. <laughs> he runs it for 
three. Second down and seven. And that's the end of the second quarter. Someone will need to pull together some bribe money as they head to their lockers. Stay with us for the halftime show, brought to you by our friends at Monsatan Industries. We make genetically altered frankenfood you'll have fun trying to identify. Well, the third quarter coming up. Bricks, this game has been a hot mess so far. Yeah, kind of like the morning after eating hot chicken wings. It's a hot mess on the exit ramp, if you know what I mean. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. If that hit didn't cripple him, it certainly left skid marks. And that's a first down from a great catch. Was it a catch, though? Let's consult at least 72 pages of rules to figure it out. And it's first and ten. Five-yard gain on that fast play. Hey, look at the coach. He's picking his nose. You know, they shouldn't put that on the Jumbotron. Seems like every time he shows him, he's either spitting, picking, grabbing himself in the privates. Hey, he should do it all at the same time. Now, that would be worthy of a Jumbotron shot. Oh, man, I love this dirty trick. The quarterback unleashes a rocket. Nicely done for a first down. Oh, and you can bury that guy because he is dead. Oh, did you see what number he was? I had to check it off my dead mutant bingo card. I only need one more. And it's first and ten. I don't know whose eyes the QB is using, but can we get him some new ones? Oh, and that one's going to hurt. He may not be able to comprehend math after that hit. What's math? Exactly. Yeah. The offense is running low on running backs. They have only two left. They need to conserve those runners now and consider passing more. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hot. And that was a bone crusher right there, folks. First and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hot. And the MFL keeps pounding out the death hits on WMFL 98.8. The greatest hits of all time. Huh? Did you just say greatest hits? Where? Hey, hey, Grim, you ever dance with the devil in the pale moonlight? Uh, this isn't the devil brick, just one of them. Oh, that don't make it any less scary. <laughs> The offense is down to their last running back. When he bites the dust, they can only pass. Yeah, well, at least they don't have to forfeit, Grim. That's 
right, but now the defense can focus on killing the receivers. Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. Straight through the uprights. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. Oh, great tackle! When his brain is unscrambled, he'll be thinking about that hit. Yeah, most likely in a convalescent home. Hot, hot one. Freaky fast ham sandwich with extra mustard for the death blow. Speaking of ham sandwiches, I'm gonna go grab one. You want anything? No, yeah, still working on my salami here, Bricks. Thanks. That's what she said. Ah, ah, didn't work that time. It was close, though. Yep. The offense lost their last running back on the previous play. Next time the offense comes out in the field, they will have no running plays. And it's first and ten. Looks like a pass, and it's bouncing right back to the QB. Oh, it's the sticky ball dirty trick. Ah, oh, pass the popcorn, Griff. Zoom in on his face. Oh, and that's when it feels like to have your teeth. Oh, and the late hit arrives right on time. When it's your time to go, it's your time. First and ten. Hot one. Hot. And the crowd goes wild. Touchdown. Touchdown. Yo, seriously, man. You think you go toe-to-toe -to -toe with me? I will wreck your world. You understand me, Junior? I'll wreck your world. Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. It's good. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. Destruction in his path, and the body toll continues to climb. <laughs> the burn returner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? You know, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He probably grabbed his pants. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot. And the defense falls for that trick all the time. <laughs> now they're mopping the players off the field. Literally. Second down and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot three. That's the way to move the chains. That's good for a first down. This game is... Oh, hold everything. Looks like there's a penalty on the play. First and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. Hot. Oh, and that one's gonna hurt. He may not be able to comprehend math after that. The offense is down to their last running back. No rest for the weary. The last runner has to suck it up and hopefully not die. 
And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. 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 And I've had it. I'm running out of excuses for this QB. You just... You just throw it to the guy in the same color. Boom, dead and down. He just sent a message with that hit. Yeah, the message was you can't kill the messenger because he's going to kill you. But then he won't be able to read the message because the messenger killed him. Ah, uh, going in circles. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two. Hey. Boom to the moon. Another loser bites the dust. In the NFL, winning is really about how much you want it, Bricks. Well, he clearly didn't want to live as much as the other guy. That's a good point, Grim. The offense has no running backs left, so this becomes a passing-only offense. Uh, they can still run it with their QB, right, Grim? Sure, they can run their QB into the defense that's feasting on runners. <laughs> Sounds like a good plan, moron. Hey, watch it! The defense is running low on line bashers. They have only two left. They need to play smart from here on out. That's defense, Grim. You guys can do much of them. Well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> it goes right through. Yeah, like a double stop burrito from Taco Hell. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. Oh, it's a punishing hit. nine-yard completion there. Hey, it ain't great if you don't score or move the chains. And that'll bring up second and one. Hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. Oh, a great catch, and he picks up a new set of downs. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two. quarter and look folks I'll be honest I don't see a chance in hell in here in a hurry up offense there is no huddle so neither team can put their players on the bench I think the defenders are scared of this guy Bricks oh you knew you were gonna see a lot of carnage today folks these teams have bad blood between them apparently they got it from the same blood mobile that usually parks outside next to the taco truck raccoon rabies blood is my thought always a player's favorite and it's first and ten Hot one. Hot. Roid rage ignites that deep down violent rage and makes you unstoppable. I'll take a run. Like he just ran into the line at the DMV. And guess what, Grim? That line ain't moving. Yeah, that was kind of my point, Bricks. And the hurry up offense wears out the defense since they can't rest their players. If you don't think you can make the interception, batting it down is the next best thing. Great advice, Grim. That receiver's gonna go far in this league if he listens to you. I wasn't talking to... Yeah, never mind. Yes, Brick, he will. Oh, what a punishing hit that was. And that's how you make a guy remember your name and your shoe size. Because he just walked all over him. One, 
That was a good throw. You're assuming he was aiming for the ground. Hmm. I don't remember that being an officially sanctioned NFL rule. And the off. It's a jailbreak. And the defense jumps offside to kill the ref. Ho oh, ho. Crowd's loving it. When in a hurry up offense, the offense needs to run out of bounds or take a timeout to stop the clock. And he snags it for six. Touchdown! Touchdown! Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. And that's the return of the ball. Returnable? You mean he can get a refund for it? No, no, Bricks. It means he can return it for... You know what? And that was a bone crusher right there, folks. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Oh, and that's how you play defense. Well, of course, he, he could have had an interception, returned it for a touchdown and changed the entire game, but I don't want to nitpick. Second down and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot First and ten. What does it feel like to get hit like that? Uh, like being dropped off a 10-story building with a refrigerator strapped to your back and landing on a fire hydrant. Yeah, great analogy. Oh, no, no, that really happened. Cod game got a little out of hand last night. You can't have five aces, you dumbass. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. Pow, with the brain scrambler. It's another turnover for the defense. Bam! Say goodnight to that guy, Bricks. Uh, good night to that guy, Bricks. You're an idiot. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot eight. And he's off to the races. He's at the 20, the 10. It's a touchdown. And if there's one thing I can't stand, it's a pretty boy who thinks he can dance. Uh, although I am 
quite a fan of guts and finger fake. Yeah, oh, quite the entertainer he is. Well, oh, yeah. I would have to agree with you, Grim. <laughs> And they line up for the extra point. Straight through the uprights. Oh, that was totally uncalled for. And that's why we love the MFL. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. Pow! And how about a little dirt sandwich? Hot. Hot one, hot two, hot three. And with another pick, the QB says, I don't know almost throw intercept. Oh, what the brutal hit! Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. They need a good return here to set up the offense. They're going to be able to return this one. Quarterback signals for a hurry-up offense. Hey, Grim, what's the hurry-up offense? There's no huddle. The offense calls plays at the line of scrimmage and plays really fast. And he zings it in there for a nine-yard completion. They are moving the ball now with authority. And that'll bring up second and one. One. Oh, man, the defense brought a sack once today. Hey, hey, don't eat him. Not until he's cooked. Third down and nine. Hot one. Hot. <laughs> they are going for it. Offense calls their first time out. Oh, thank God. I've been sitting on this burrito for the last two hours. I gotta go. Yeah, thanks, Bricks. Really appreciate that transparency. He's rumbling and stumbling. He could go all the way. He just put that guy out of his misery and says, who's next? It's a touchdown! Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. It's good. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a broad in my bed, it was a chicken. Oh, and he breaks free. He's at the 40. He's in. And the defense is on his heel. Boom! And like the Titanic, his ship just went down. Hey, hey, I almost got dead mutant bingo. All I need is 77 to bite it.
And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hot. And he's off to the races. Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just... The defense lost their final line basher. Lucky for them, their offense is out there on the field now, or they forfeit. Yeah, they got luck just like Big Ren. I was playing candy crocs the other day, and I got a cavity with herpes. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. If that hit didn't cripple him, it certainly left skid marks. into a hurry-up offense. He's looking for a quick score. Aren't we all, Grim? Aren't we all? Two timeouts burned, and you have to wonder, Bricks, are they desperate or are they in control? Yeah, I'm speaking from experience, Grim, but it really is both at the same time, and I have mastered it. And he finds open spaces running toward the end zone. Turn on your jet, you son of a bitch. The quarterback burns his last timeout. He can't stop the clock anymore. And the offense goes into a hurry-up to pick up the pace of the game. And like a monkey trying... Oh, and he just left an outline on the ground like he was trying to wipe out the dinosaurs. Must be opposite day because he's the one who just got wiped out. His cleats are caked in blood and guts, and he's looking to score. The 20. QB needs to stop. Hey, yeah, uh, Bricks, check the rule book. Is that a penalty? Why would I have the rule book? Oh, for fuck's sake. I don't even have it. Too little, too late. And the offense jumps off sides to kill the ref. They say, we're mad as hell and not going to take it anymore. The quarterback shifts gears and goes into his hurry-up offense. Oh, and he breaks free and has nothing but open field in front of him. And the team refuses to quit. They stay alive with four new downs.
Now, there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sinners then. Straight through the uprights. The Atlanta Vultures got their butts whipped and lose by forfeit. It's probably a good thing the game ended up in forfeit. They weren't going to make it out of the stadium alive with this performance anyway. The fans were going to kill them if the opposition didn't. Gotta love that fan passion. Let's hear what the game's MVP has to say about this carnage. I'd rather listen to Sarah Palin read the entire works of Shakespeare while tripping my brains out. Uh, actually, that sounds kind of fun. Today's final game stats are brought to you by the Microhard Corporation. They get it right every up.